Coming up, uh, coming in on a Hillsborough County courtroom this morning, the defense begins calling witnesses in the Richard McTeer murder trial. McTeer is the man accused of throwing his ex-girlfriend's baby out of a car window onto I-275, killing the child five years ago. For what we can expect now, we want to go live to the courthouse and Eric Waxler. Good morning, Eric. Yeah, the defense will get its turn today. That after the prosecution wrapped up yesterday by introducing some new DNA evidence against McTeer. On the witness stand, there was an oral surgeon who testified for the prosecution that bite marks found on three-month-old Emmanuel Murray came from McTeer. Another witness also for the prosecution said that blood found on McTeer's car and on the shorts that he was wearing at the time of this came from the baby. Now, this all happened five years ago. Emmanuel was found dead on the side of the interstate. Prosecutors say McTeer killed the baby in a jealous rage after an argument with Jasmine Bedwell, the child's mother. But the defense will continue to try and put holes in Bedwell's story today. They say she initially blamed an uncle for killing the baby, and during testimony, Bedwell changed her story, saying Emmanuel was accidentally dropped as she and McTeer fought, as opposed to McTeer purposely throwing the baby onto concrete. The case could go to the jury as early as tomorrow, and McTeer is facing the death penalty if convicted in this case. We'll be live streaming this trial again today for you on ABC Action News Now. Live outside the Hillsborough County Courthouse, Eric Waxler, ABC Action News.